What's going on, you guys? My name is Coco Crystal. You can call me Crygo, and welcome back to our Pokemon Neo X randomizer Nuzlocke in the last episode. We battled off with one of the last Team Flare admins we're gonna have to battle for a while. Next up, we're battling Zeroisk and stopping this ultimate weapon from going off. Am I scared? Hell yeah, I'm scared, because this guy has a team of gods. It's basically all I have to say um, is that this, this team is very, very scary. But we'll have a chance, I think. Which floor would you like to go to? Uh, B3, please. This Pangoro scares me. He's got Iron Fist, so all his punches are going to do so much. It's fighting types that always scare me. So, let's do this. What is Zero Wessex's voice? He's a good little punchy man. So the Pokemon will receive, and the Pokemon will gather here, and what we need, what need to be, and add up. I don't know what it means. Our preparations are complete. As you are the team's de deputy leader, I'm counting on you. <clears throat> One push of a button, we can activate the ultimate weapon from this room. I believe I'm being chosen. I believe being a chosen one means you have the potential to change the future. Whether we activate the ultimate weapon or leave it safely, underground will rest upon you if you activate this potential or not. Mm hmm. Uh, sure. Ho ho ho! We're looking at the future possible leader of Team Flower. Now, child, tell me, am I stronger than Lysander? I mean, I beat Lysander for the first time, but. I don't know his name. Oh, it's a double battle! I did not know that part. Oh, shit. Okay, you can choose one or the other. Which one is he gonna attack? I'm gonna Aura Sphere this thing, and we're gonna X Scissor and hope and pray this thing dies. Are we fast? Yo, we're faster. Please kill. Okay, that did a lot. Okay, he can either take up my Dialga, which AI-wise should be the threat. Okay, I didn't touch dead. Which means I'm taking a hit as a Chrono. Chrono's taking a hit right here. Okay, that's not bad, actually. I'll take it. As long as the Porygon doesn't use any kind of any normal type moves, we're fine. Now, the thing is... This team scares me a lot. Switch in Sheila. Switch in Sheila. Kronos needs to, fo needs to focus on this Porygon Zed, because for some reason this thing's bulky as hell. And we'll body slam this plate off. Get it off my screen. Put it all down. Dope. What's Porygon gonna do? Porygon has Psy Shock, which is a little scary, but it's not that bad. Sheila can eat it. I have faith in Sheila. She's thick. She's she's thick. Okay, he might send in Plangoro next, which oh no, it's Entei, which means Sacred Fire, which means bad, right? If I double in on Entei, we could have a chance, but I'd have to do it at the cost of Sheila. And I can't sack Pokemon right now. Which means... Oh, this is a bad one. This is a really bad one. I don't know the decision I'm supposed to make. Okay, let's send Entei in. And let's get rid of this Entei, and... That's the decision! I think his Entei can die in one shot, but it's gonna take a lot to kill him. Okay, there's a hyper potion, so. Ow, 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 ow! That being said, Emu is kind of my answer to a Pangoro, so. Jesus Christ, he's faster. Okay. I'm gonna Earth Power again, and then full restore. I hope he repeats the same set of activities. And takes the first Pokemon that's actually outsped Kronos. Which is scary as fuck! Okay. Ente is dead. I could have flown, actually, would have saved me a bit. However, I think we can eat something unless this freaking Porygon Z kicks him out. Okay. We've got three Pokemon. Kronos is already in battle. We've got to send Teeths in. 
Okay, that is scary. Because of everything it can do to me right now. So we're gonna Aura Sphere, and I'm going to... Not Hyper Potion. I'm gonna Mega Evolve and do the exact same thing. We need to double into this, because this, this, this Mammoth Swine is going to fuck us up if we don't do anything, and this could be the end of the run, which I am not about to do, because this is, we're too close. Okay, okay, good, 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 good. Dealt with, dope. The last things that are concerning are Scizor and Pingoro. There you go. We're so high level, but... Okay, I think I can eat a Psychic because I'm bulky. Jesus Christ, there's Pangoro. That thing can screw us up really bad, so... We're gonna Aura Sphere him, and I will take the turn to heal. Yep, yep, that's the decision. I have three Pokemon! This isn't good. I only have three Pokemon, keep in mind. Oh, fuck. Don't double in. Do not double in. Ah! Okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I'm actually really glad about the move I decided to make. I played with fire a little bit there. Do I regret the decision? No, not really, actually. Because that... I think that was the only way I'm winning. The problem is... I got, like... Two more battles to go through or at least I've got one Lysander battle and another Lysander battle to go through which are the big important ones obviously like the the other like team flare guys and there's my chest okay uh the problem is now I should not stay in because this thing will what is the word Fuck me up. <laughs> Tis the season! Jesus Christ. Okay. Okay, that's the Mega Scissor. Mega Scissor gets more bulky when it Mega Evolves, which sucks. So, I have to hope we don't take too much damage from this thing, because it's got Technician, so Bullet Punch hurts like a bitch. Come on, come on, Sheila, Sheila, Sheila! Okay. Nothing. It's fine, we got an intimidation drop. We have two Pokemon to go through the rest of this game. I had to switch out because the freaking special attack drop fucked us. I can only dig. I can literally only dig. That's the only thing I can do. I'm surprised in bullet punch. Oh, double no, he didn't. Did he? I flinched him. Okay, I I know that I'm pretty sure that our Um dig should kill this scissor, so. Okay, I have to dual dual run the entire game now. Which is gonna suck. I have two Pokemon to run the rest of this freaking team flare base. Fine. That did so much damage. I can't believe we're gonna win this, I think. But Jesus Christ, this freaking Porygon 2 or Zed has become an issue. Oh, that's gonna hurt a lot more, isn't it? That's a crit, okay. Keeps healing with the leftovers, that's the problem. Oh my god, okay, I can kill this right now. The end. Done. Get off my screen. Goodbye. I think the part of the issue with this was dealing with that Porygon. Yeah, I'm not happy with that. Oh, you're wonderful. Your Pokemon are amazing. I don't care. Ah! Can we do one of those Nuzlocks where I get healing tokens? I don't care. I'm ignoring them. And get this. Get this. I'm... One of them... Is the button to push one? 
I'm going to push the blue button. Yes. Isn't, do they both set it off? You pressed it over here, you both first pitch. So if you, but really, I'm still going to activate the ultimate weapon. I know that I promised that I wouldn't if you pressed the cook button. Now if you use the potential cut of us, I'll just use my robot here. Click, click, and power on. I need to find out. Look at the monitor. Is there a place I can get an encounter? We're gonna really need one. I really need this encounter. I am gonna randomize the legend, I think. As much as Xerneas would probably be really useful here, if I get a different legend, I might be happier with it. And I might have a bit more of a chance because Oh, you have to fight Lysander one more time. He has X defenses. Oh. That Bouffalant was a problem last time. I don't have a fighting type to deal with it this time. It walls my entire teams, by the way. So, yeah. I, I have no clue how I'm beating him. This Because this Bouffalant scares the fuck out of me. I, can I think I just need a Mega Ball immediately and just start hitting it with things. It's got a Rocky Helmet, though. It's bulky, so if I can set it up, if it uses Sword Stance, we're going to have an issue. But if I can set it up so it uses Seed Bomb or something, I can possibly win? Because that's the only thing that, that's the only concern. The rest of the team I can kind of deal with. So now we have to go all the way to Chio Senge. But I would like to look and see if there's any encounters I, I, you know, areas I've missed so I can get them. Like that haunted area, isn't there a, is there a Pokemon I can get down there? Cause that would be, that would be ideal. I'm trying to think. No, this isn't happy music. Fuck, man. I need to figure out where I can get Earthquake as well. There's a lot of things I need to figure out now. Jesus Christ. Okay, hold on. Er, earthquake. Wow, I'm not spelling right today. Quake, TM, Pokemon, X. Where is it? I don't know. I need to find this out, and then I need to look at my map really quick. Where is it? Pokemon X. Oh, um, TM is given to reward by being the fifth gym. Earthquake is on a route 22. Okay. Is that, oh, by the way, I wanted to say, King's Rock came in clutch in that game. Okay, so who died first? You. Then you. Dude, this game took so many lives. This game's taken so many Pokemon. Do I have anything that's holding an item that I should take back? Nope. Okay. I have nothing to help this thing out. So, T Route 22. Let's look at our map really quick. This might be the rest of this episode, just by the way. Lost Hotel. Let me just find this out. Is there a static Pokemon in Lost Hotel? Pokemon. Because I feel like there's something there. Uh, let's see. Is there a Pokemon? Let's see. Doesn't look like... Oh, there's trash can Pokemon. Which is all your Rotom forms. Which I, I get... It's only on Tuesdays you get your Rotom forms. Jesus, I consider it static, but... Here, let's look up static encounters... Pokemon X. I'm trying to figure this out because I need Pokemon, right? Well, there's Sea Spirit's Den. Have I gone to Sea Spirit's Den? I don't think so. The Palace Power Plant we've been to. Apart from Place we've been to. Or Palace. Is it Place or Palace? It's Palace. Connecting Cave we've been through. I've been all the way to Glittering Cave. I'm just trying to figure this out, guys. 
Reflection Cave we've done. We did Shalar City. Coromain. We haven't gone to Spirit's Den. Maybe we should figure out how to get there. Because I have no clue. Dendamil. Frost Cavern. Lost Hotel. Went all the way to Anastar. Can I go past Anastar yet? Because I can. I go to Terminus Cave. Let's look at how to get to the sea... What is it? Sea something cavern? Sea Spirit's Den? Sea... Sea Spirit's Den. Pokemon X. How do I get there? No. Return later. I can only go... Can you not access Sea Spirit's Den? Because that'll be maddening. Let's find out. Okay, here, let's find out. Yeah, it's only... Can we empty having no wild Pokemon guys? However, during the post game... Oh, you, can, you can't even get encounters? What if I try? Like, oh, I need to get a fly Pokemon now. Fuck. Fuck. Jesus Christ. Okay. This is gonna be the rest of the episode, probably. I don't think we're gonna move on to this next area because I need Pokemon. And right now, it's not what I got. I have... I got two Pokemon on my team, and... Just gonna say, I don't think our odds are too great. I'm just saying. And there's a freaking Cuffer Greek Will-O-Wisp that exists, so... That's the thing that I have to deal with as well. Let's see if we can go to Sp Sea Spirit's Cave, which means I have to take a freaking Surfmon as well. It's here. What's this? Pokeball Factory. I just want free Pokemon. <laughs> and I don't know where to get them. Because we have two Pokemon going into this Lysander fight. And it's not okay. Oh, I need to get the Pokemon here, because otherwise I can't access them. I need to surf. Okay, let's see what fighting type moves I can get, actually, to deal with this freaking... Do I have any... Either of you get Poison Power Punch? Nope. I mean, I could Swords Dance. Like, that could be an option, right? That's an option, right? Using Swords Dance and just... Going through the Pokemon like that? Right now, I think I need as many moves as possible, but if I sword Dance, I can deal with it, right? So right now, I have Crunch, which I need, Dragon Claw, which I need, and Poison Jab. Isn't 100% useful right now. Let's get rid of it. I'll do it. That way, we can sword Dance up, and then hopefully start punching through things pretty quickly. That's your hope. But let's see if I can get a Sea Spirit's Den, because if it's like an area around the cave, then I'll get a Sea Encounter then, I guess. That's all I can- oh, I don't even have Surf on you. Jesus Christ. Okay. This game fell apart so fast. I mean, I guess the Team Flare base thing is difficult. It's designed to be difficult, but... Is it really difficulty if you're just being thrown at crazy hard battles back to back to back without a chance for other challenges? That's all I'm wondering. Like, dude. It's wild how difficult this just suddenly became. If there are any gift mons I could know about, that'd be great. I might look at that between episodes. Cause we might... Oh, I see the water sparkling if there's a mega stone in it. But I doubt it. Okay, we already did Route 12. If I can figure out where to get Surf, we'd be fine, but... I don't know how to get Sea Spirit's Cave. Let's get my Super Pals up. Because I need to freaking get to this place. Uh, okay, I've already been here. I think I got an encounter out here, right? Yes, I definitely did. I got Froakie out here. Which means I have to do this all myself. Azure Bay, I got an encounter. I believe. Okay, we have to look for the... Okay, I'm going diagonal. I should find it. 
eventually. I hope. Why can't I access it? Like, I keep going by it. It's... Because this is like the end of the edge of the map, right? Ooh, did I figure it out? This is Sea Spirit's Den, right? Can I get encounters in here? I'm wondering. I don't think you can. It sucks, but I'm gonna try. I have honey. I have one. It's not gonna work, is it? Fuck. Okay. Did I get an Azura Bay encounter? I'm pretty sure I did. Oh, okay, this is... And Route 22 is all the way down here, isn't it? Route 21, Route 20, Route 22 is to Victory Road. I can get Earthquake. That is a thing I can do. If I get Earthquake, I can Sword Stance against this Bouffalant. And then Earthquake him. I think that's the best decision. I need a Strength Mon because don't have that. If I can just have Sword Stance on this Garchomp, I actually think I can just sweep her entire team. Or his entire team. I'm gonna need to fly Mon. I need to get rid of this thing. <sighs> this has become so much more difficult. I'm scrambling for items and for Pokemon and it's not helping too much. I don't need another repel right now. 22 is the Tour Ferrer way. Oh, is that on the other, the other side? Right? It's on the other side. Ooh, what's this? I don't have Surf. Fuck. I want to explore now because I can find encounters. So let me go across. Um. But, oh, fuck, man. I just want Surf. Okay, I need to get Surf now. I know half this episode has been me scrambling, but that's because I, that's the internal side of me. There's also another part of me that's also like, if I, if I lose right now, what do I upload for the next Friday, Monday, Tuesday, Monday, Wednesday, and then next Friday is the stream, so. We'll see. We will see, because I don't want to lose any more Pokemon. I really was trying not to. I think we went through an episode without losing Pokemon. You don't have Surf. We went through an episode without having to lose a Pokemon, which is great, but now we lost the rest of our team with freaking Zeroisk. Just because of that freaking- of all the things to cause issues, it was a freaking Porygon Z, which I actually don't know if there's a better way for me to fight that thing. That thing was bulky as fuck. Okay, let's see. Let's see if I can do something down here, or is it just a dead end? Ooh. I need waterfall. There's something down there. I guarantee that. I would have been happy if I had my encounter. But I've already been here. Um, what else do I use? Oh, we use Snorlax in, as a token, right? Yes. Because I could go back and get Snorlax as a static, but that's cheap. I think, honestly, we're stuck with what we got. <laughs> that sucks. Okay, between episodes... I might level to level 80. I think that's what I'm gonna have to do. I'm gonna level my Pokemon to level 80. I don't care what you think of me. <laughs> I need to win. Not just because I need to win, but also because this game is getting insane. And being that I only have two Pokemon, I don't have access to like, IV training, EV breeding, same opposite or direct, but you know what I mean. I have to try to figure this out myself. And, if, and that kind of means level yourself up to a point where you are able to actually take hits from Pokemon like this. So in the next episode, we're going to be level 80. And we'll be ready to fight Lysander. I will do some research to see if there's any more GIF Pokemon. And uh, and then we will go on to Lysander. I will re-randomize certain things about the game, like the static encounters. So Xerneas will not be a Xerneas. And yeah... Oh, that's the, that's the tea. If you guys have enjoyed, make sure you click the like button down below to support the channel and the series a lot. Don't be afraid to subscribe to the Crystal Crew. And as always, guys, I will see you, you, and you in the next video. See you then, guys.